Good afternoon everyone, today is 23rd of April and as you might be aware of, today is celebrated as English Language Day. On this day we celebrate English language. Now you all know that there are many different languages, right? And many people also speak few different languages. We also learn English, right? Our mother tongue, our mother language is the most beautiful language. It really is. However, nowadays we use other languages as well. English is one of them. So today we will make corner bookmarks because I am sure you will be reading a lot and I'm sure you will be needing a corner bookmark so that you can mark your book when you are finished reading and close the book and continue later. So today we will make corner bookmarks. Before we do that, I wanted to share something with you. I wanted to share with you few things on how to improve your English. Some everyday habits to improve your English. Now, we all know that learning a language takes time, effort and dedication. But the most successful language learners, they find a way so that their learning becomes a part of their daily life. If you want to improve, your English practice should become a daily habit. I want to share with you three things you can do and you should do every day to improve your English. And that means all these things, all these three things every day. First thing is pronunciation. You should be practicing your pronunciation every day so that when you speak, you speak clearly and everyone can understand you. Practicing pronunciation daily will make a huge improvement in a short space of time. That means pronouncing correctly, pronouncing correct sounds, with fluency. You can also read out loud to improve your pronunciation and fluency. Five or ten minutes a day is enough, but it must be consistently, every day. You can also sing songs in English. Number two. Absorb English. To absorb means to take information, to take new ways of, of expressing, new words, listening songs, seeing movie, reading book, or just mixing it all up. To absorb means to take in information, how did we say you will do it? You will learn new words, new ways of expressing. You will listen songs or see a movie or read a book. This can also be a 10 minute, a 10 minute activity. But you have to find something that interests you. It should not look like English practice. It should look like something that is of your interest. You can decide when do you want to do it. For example, when you are having breakfast. And number three. Number three is write. Write. Daily writing practice. Daily writing practice. Writing every day has some amazing benefits. It can take few minutes 
and it can be only for you. It will help your vocabulary. Writing is one of the best ways to remember the vocabulary already learned and phrases which you have already learned. So every day you can write. It can be a five-minute job. You don't have to show it to anyone. It can be only for you. This means you can make your own sentences. You can improve the sentences. You can also check the mistakes you made. These are three things which we should do in our daily life. What did we say? First one is pronunciation. Second one is absorb English. And third one is write. Now, let's go back to our activity corner bookmark. There are few things that you will need. You will need a colorful chart paper. You will need a glue. And you will need a pair of safety scissors. These are three things you will need. So you will take a piece of paper, piece of chart paper, and you can fold it to get equal sides. All sides should be equal. And we will cut it. Now, when you fold it from the other side, you should fold it carefully, press it, open it and now see you have a middle this is the middle of your paper right this is the middle and you see these triangles one two three four one of them we can cut out but you have to cut it on the line straight on the line you cut it out and you don't need it. You can put it aside. And now just fold these two together and put some glue. And paste it together. Now you will be able to put it on your book. You will be able to put it in on your book. You can make some eyes, right, like I have made. You can cut out a little bit of chart paper and you can paste the eyes. One eye and the second eye. There it is. Now I have used the whitener to make white white over here. And for some of these I have used teeth. Here they are. I have just cut a little bit of white paper. And you can also paste some teeth on your corner bookmark. You can make a bird, you can make any animal. A frog, a rabbit. You just have to paste the ears for the rabbit. So you paste the teeth inside and there is our monster, monster bookmark. So this is our bookmark. This is how we can make a bookmark and I'm sure you will be reading a lot. You also try making some and send me the photos. Looking forward. That's all for today. Happy English Day. Happy English Language Day. See you soon.